trying to make it. Oh. Hey everybody, I'm Jake. And I'm Owen. And today it's time for Nickelodeon Trivia. <laughs> Old school, probably. Not. To that early 2000s? I'm not, SpongeBob was probably the newest show. Well, he's on 99. This. He started. What, what, I want to say Cat Dog and them were after 2000. Really? Yeah. Oh, wow. What about Fairly Odd Parents? That was pretty late. Yeah. This is a random rock rock. He's pretty early. Yeah, he was pretty. I'm just wondering which one is like the like the latest show that we're dealing with. I probably had trouble with Blue's Clues. Adora. I watched a lot of Blue's Clues. <laughs> I watched Rocket Power, but I didn't like it. I haven't seen Rocket in years. Did you beef it like the squid? Hmm? Did you beef it like the squid? <sighs> that show is fucking terrible. <laughs> yeah, My problem with the show. You get him right now. You mean you just do guy? The fucking main kid is a complete dick. And he never learns anything. Never learns anything. There's no lesson. He rips his friend off of a trophy by cheating, and then he still ends up like. Getting the trophy in the end because his friend just lets him have it. There's no lesson learned. You're already for this trivia thing. So this is our era, right? Would you call that this Rough. is our cartoon era? Yeah. I mean, I watched a lot of Angry Beavers. I watched a fair amount of Cat Dog. I watched a lot of Aubrey of Monsters. That was a great show. Yeah. Um, I have seen some Dora. Yeah, I know. I've just just seen enough. But... Need to buy the DVDs now, so when we get old and crippled, we'll just be in the home. Oh, time for more of our So what level? We're going to be three. Okay, well, read the levels real quick. Level one, I watch Nickelodeon sometimes. Two, I watch Nickelodeon when I can, but my homework gets me a little Fuck busy. Homework, yeah. Level three, I get a little cranky if I miss my Nickelodeon. Yeah, that's true. Four, I'd rather watch Nickelodeon than almost anything. That's not true. Level five, Nickelodeon is my life. Okay, we should both do level three, level but three. but to beat it, we have to do a level five. Okay, okay, we'll try. Or how about this? A level five, then next time level four, and then next time level three. <laughs> Down to level one. <laughs> we took <laughs> out the kids ones. Yeah, there's no kids. I don't even know. I guess they'd ones. still be considered kids, but... Yeah. But we're big kids. This is like a picture. And you just said, who's that? I don't know. It's like, what kind of animal is... I don't even know who the fuck that is. Boots? It's a squirrel. Oh, how many colors are Antifa's vest? I don't know who Tico is. Fuck that. That's hard. Get out of here. It is. He's right on the front. Oh. <laughs> Someone wouldn't tell that it's a squirrel. <laughs> I'm supposed to say that and the kid goes, Thanks, Bob. <laughs> I guess they have the picture to look at. Uh, your Youngest Jake's player goes first. There's no oldest players ever. <laughs> I got lucky with two ones Sorry, with beards. Oldest. That's right. We just need to make a beard. <laughs> More beard laws in games. <laughs> Beard, most guys with the biggest beard plays Nickelodeon so trivia first. So when are you gonna shave your beard? Never. I am Daggett. Daggett. And you are. I have no. You don't know? <laughs> it's been so long. Ichabod since Crane, right? It's Ichabod. Or his name is at least Ichabod. I, I feel it's like so called, long. I think it's because they call him Ickus or something. Because there's Olivia, there's Crumb, and there's Ickus. I remember Crumb. See, it's been a while since I've seen. I'm pretty, it yeah, better look it up. I'm pretty sure it was Olivia. Yeah, it was Dexter's Lab and Powerpuff Girls. So I was going to say, back in the day, man, bad guys always wore red high heels shoes. His name is Akis. Just Akis. Okay. I, s I swear it's short for Ichabod Crane. Yeah. This might be terribly, but terribly wrong. <clears throat> All right, two. So I'm going to do choose whatever I want. Not that it really matters. But you want? Can I, I not look it. at the questions? Look at the questions, but I read it. So I get to choose based on the question. Is that the deal? No. No, of course it is. Pick <laughs> you pick a color. No, but I get to read a color. No, 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 no. You hey, pick a color. Why? Why would you pick a color if you, you don't know get what the question read, was? No, you don't get to read it. You pick a color. Because the idea of the white oh, was yeah, you need a color. You need the color. So okay, fine. <laughs> pick a color and I read it. And you get to read it. <laughs> no. It's <laughs> getting yellow, then. Because you, we can all see them. I could be looking at the questions right now. No. Well, then why are they fades out? Because the answers are on the back. <laughs> they should both be on the back if you're reading uh, them. On Chalk Zone, what's the name of Rudy Tabuti's favorite superhero? God damn it. Chalk Zone. <laughs> Chalk Zone of all the cartoons. Fucking Chalk Zone. I don't know. Snack. Snack. <laughs> Just like that. Give her that card. Fuck that card. <laughs> we haven't watched probably any of the old shows in a long time. Maybe Sp I could probably get some SpongeBob. Yeah, me too. Uh, uh, one. one. Purple or yellow. 
Well, I'm read it. Why wouldn't you? You can see them. They're right there. Which one? Purple? <laughs> I guess yeah. you did lay those face. It'd be number three. Um, because whether or not I read the question or you look at it, it's still being asked and you don't know the answer. It's well, not like it's a, it's it doesn't not like, work for white because you could go through and read and find one that you know. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> That's fine. You need to look into that. Please look up the game and prove him wrong because I know I'm right. Not you. <laughs> Maybe we should have done number two. <laughs> okay. Name the Angry Beavers two younger siblings. I did not remember this. I kind of remember the characters, but... Chomp and Buddy. No. <laughs> Chelsea and Stacy. They got sisters. I'm just going to swear a lot because it's supposed to be a kid's game. Why were the Angry Beavers forced to leave their parents' dam? Oh... Ah, I saw this one. Um, oh, wait. It's not because they were too old. You're not ticking on me, are you? Don't no, you. I could give you a hint. You shouldn't, though. Cause <laughs> what, did it have to do... I'm just going to guess. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Did it have to do with Daggett's bed biting? The mother had a second litter, so they do more. Ah, I was going to say, it pertains to the card I just had. Yeah. <laughs> uh, poop around. Maybe we'll finally get one. <laughs> Which character on Ah, Real Monsters comes from Chernobyl? Crown, whatever. Yeah. No, no, it's a bleed up. What's the name of the amusement park on uh, the adventures of Jimmy Neutron? Oh, oh my god, I am not. In <laughs> I know that episode too, but I wouldn't know that. Is it the one where they sneak in? No, <laughs> Sounds kind of right. Is it. Is it. Technology Land? Retro Land. But I'm gonna step down to two. I can't do this. <laughs> Should I step down to two as well? Let me look at both. <laughs> it's up to you. Let's try level two. Should have done three. But <laughs> um, number two, which greaser dog has a crush on dog or cat dog? Oh, I don't know her name. She's a poodle. Dirty. Shriek. Makes sense. I'm pretty sure she's a poodle. You want to know what question three was? Yeah. On cat dog, what body part do cat and dog share? Mm, stomach? Yeah. <laughs> that would have been <laughs> it. Too bad, though. You went to two. Maybe we should just... For sure I was right. It's the poodle. Yeah, I know you were right, but you didn't have the right name. <laughs> it's a poodle! I don't care, you don't have the right name. <laughs> Give it to me. What former Batman actor played the role of Principal Ken Schwinger on The Adventures of Pete and Pete? Batman. Yeah, that's right, I didn't know that. I didn't know he was in that show. <laughs> I gotta watch that show again now. Just give me number two. How does Dora the Explorer say, let's go, in Spanish? Fuck. Oh, vamanos? Yeah! But my nose, I could kind of hear her say it in my head. <laughs> this is a test of your memory. Okay. Which is not good. Which of the Angry Beaver's sisters most closely resembles Daggett in personality? I don't remember the name. That was the memory part. <laughs> I actually do. I remember both. Shelly? No. It was Chelsea. What was it? Oh, Shelly? It was a Stacy. It was Stacey. Chelsea and Stacy. Three. I already just put it out of my mind. I'll do two. We'll just stick with two. Who's the lifeguard at the community swimming pool on Cat Dog? Wait, is it their neighbor, the mouse? If it's not, I'm just wrong. No. Okay. Rancid Rabbit. Ah. You're on two? Yep. On Chalk Zone, who is the class bully? Oh, see, this is where names come in. I'm bad at him. I can picture him and everything, but... What does he look like? He's kind of square-headed, I think. Yeah. I could sort of picture him. Does he have any other distinguishing features? He's a fucker teeth. Yeah, like most bullies. Oh, are, yeah. you, are you trying to hint that his thing is his name? Scar, Scargale. Bull nerd. I was wondering if he looked like a nerd. <laughs> like, did he have glasses and messed no. up teeth? No, he's a bully. But he's a bull nerd. He bullies nerds. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm terrible at names. If you keep getting name ones, I'm fucked. I want that red one back. Even though Oswald is an octopus. What octopus thing can't he do? Squirt ink? Swim. Or squirt ink. Really? That's what it says. <laughs> so do you get it? Yeah, I do. Right. Multiple ways. What the fuck is Oswald? It's that weird blue octopus with a top hat. I've never seen the show, but I remember Ask Oswald or something. <laughs> okay. Or squirt ink. Yeah. One or the other. Other than Steve, who else on Blue's Clues wears green stripes? No. Do you have an actual answer? I think it's the chair. The chair talks. <laughs> Is that your answer? Yeah, sure. Right, it's Steve's grandma. Oh. You never see her. Maybe one episode. <laughs> she must have been on one episode. 
Which character on Oswald lives in the Igloo Arms apartment building? Henry? Johnny Snowman? Or SpongeBob SquarePants? <laughs> I'm gonna guess Henry. Dumbass. What? It's an igloo. Johnny Snowman. I thought maybe Henry was a penguin and it was trying to trick me, obviously. <laughs> No, nope, it wasn't. Because it's fucking, it's not, is he Oswald the Octopus? I think Spongebob was the trick. Whatever. <laughs> what crimson crustaceans are often seen dancing on the Amanda show? Crabs. What? <laughs> you don't remember? It's lobsters, doesn't it? Yeah, it's lobsters. Oh, you said crabs. I would have asked you to, I would have asked you to elaborate though, because it's the dancing lobsters, specifically. <laughs> I fucking hated the Amanda show. <laughs> Ask Amanda! I guess I'll move closer to you. Hi. What is the name of the tour bus from The Big Help that travels the country? The Big Help? The Big Help. Oh, here's The Big Help. Big? The Big Help. Mopey Go. What the fuck is that? I don't know what that is either. It's probably like from the 80s. No, I think it's a new kids show thing. Well, it can't be too new. I'm gonna have to drop down to one, Jake. This is embarrassing. Yeah, you probably should have on this one. <laughs> you really should have. Number two. Another fucking show. In a hundred deeds for Eddie McDowd. Never heard of it. Who turned Eddie McDowd into a dog? Wizard. A drifter. That was pretty close. Drifting wizard. <laughs> Are we going to level one, Jake? How about we choose a question that's a show that we've heard of? So we, how about we do that? We ask, have you heard of this show? Have you heard of this show? All right. I, I don't want to just make up rules for this game because I don't like it. <laughs> but, like, my new rule could be if you land on a color I already have, you can answer the level five question for that color. You can take any color. Let's get this game over. You want to do that? Sure. All right. So you're taking purple. I'm going to ask you the level five question. Who do the angry beavers consider their mortal enemies? Humans. To be more specific? Hunters? No, lumberjacks. Oh, Trees. How's that a level five question? It's pretty close with humans. Who we are pretty close. All right. I like that rule. It kind of adds a little spice. It doesn't make it negative. Let's see. Level two is SpongeBob. All right, do that too. On SpongeBob SquarePants, where is Sandy Cheeks originally from? Texas. What the fuck? <laughs> That's easy. Yeah, it's supposed to be. It's level two. Question three is easy. On SpongeBob SquarePants, but what does Mr. Proud like more than money? Uh, more money? No, oh, his daughter. Oh. <laughs> it wasn't easy for me. <laughs> On Rugrats, who are Grandpa Lou's children? I'll type the two brothers, right? Dad and Angelica's dad. One Stu. <laughs> is the other one Lou? Maybe a second chance, though. Because you're on the right track. <laughs> Drew? Yeah! <laughs> you keep that color. Stu and Drew Pickles. <laughs> I almost knew that. It took me a second to remember which parents were related. Yeah. True or false? In an episode of Rugrats, Angelica once overdosed on cookies. True. True. In no more cookies episode. <laughs> Those questions are dumb. She always goes, foaming at the mouth. Yeah. All right, double purple time, level five question. On the Angry Beavers, who is the brother's wrestling hero? Ah, oh, you're not going to get this. The polarizing. The Grappa, El Grappadura. <laughs> or is SpongeBob. Ooh. How about a well, level four is fucking eat. What are SpongeBob's color of his eyes? It's level four. <laughs> I can't find it, too. <laughs> what about five? Name an episode of Cousin Skeeter's directed by the NBA Shaquille O'Neal. No, screw that. Do number <laughs> two. Or three. I don't care. Two. Two. On Wild Thornberries, what shape are Elsa's glasses? Round? All right. Look at it. It's literally blue. Who doesn't know Spongebob <laughs> Live? You can just look at this. <laughs> it's fucking true. It's like <laughs> right there. It's like, it's right on the board, too. That's a level five. It's a level I four. can't see it. <laughs> what was the name of the All That Talk Show slash Oprah spoof? Ophelia. No. Okra. Okra. Like that vegetable oh, okra. I never guess that. It's been a while. It's probably, it's probably been, some of these, it's been. Oh. 
Oh, wait. Well over 10 years. Just saying. I got the last color I need. I thought you had all the colors. No. Okay. Which character also pops up behind Helga when she's professing her love? God damn it! Eugene! No! No, it's, um... Brittany. <laughs> Alright. What two elements are featured on the outside of Cat Dog's house? You don't remember it? It's like, it's two houses put together. Yeah. I assume one's like a dog house. Sort of shape. Uh, there's a windmill. <laughs> uh... There's a weather vane, a bone, one's a bone, one half's a bone, one half's a litter box. <laughs> you figure out what your final answer is, then tell me. <laughs> a bone and a fish. There you go. I'm telling you, I haven't watched these in like 10 years, man. Six. Six. Except for Spongebob, which they still play 24-7. Going for double red, double five red. Five red. On um, what SpongeBob SquarePants episode did SpongeBob create a doodle of himself that came to life? Is it just called Doodle Bob? No. The episode's called Freaky Doodle. Ah. Doodle Bob is his name. Yeah. All right. Cosmo of the Fairly Odd Parents isn't known for his magical prowess. When Chimmy asked for a chocolate shake, what did he get? A chocolate cake, a chocolate snake, or a choppy lake? Snake. Chocolate snake, you got it. That's one that's still kind of weird. <laughs> you wanna know what number two was? What? True or false? Kid contestants on Figure It Out were actors. False. <laughs> yeah. They were real kids with quotation marks around for some reason. <laughs> so they weren't real kids. <laughs> they were real but they were actors. Yeah. <laughs> no. What famous actress as comedian does the narration for each episode of Brother Garcia? Um, he is Spanish, Mexican, Spanish. Oh, Mexican. fucking the the fat guy who does comedy. Oh my god, isn't Carlos Mencia? Nope. Thank God. <laughs> he played Luigi <laughs> on the Super Mario Bros. Super Show on the movie. Oh, I don't know. I think that's it. John Leguizamo. <laughs> John Legzombie. <laughs> John, John Legzombie, you know? The Spanish Luigi. <laughs> Spanish Luigi with Legzombie legs. <laughs> I knew what I meant. Yeah, I guess. I've seen some Mary's Inns recently. I don't know if I answered it, but uh, just because we haven't had one yet, let's do it. Okay. Name the miserable teacher heading the class in the Vader Zoo. Oh, fuck. Hell yeah. <laughs> it's an evil name. Well, you know, most teachers are Mrs. like... Mrs. Crabapple. Close. Miss Bitters. Double yellow. I'm not going to get there. What color do I do? I need purple. It's going down, Jake. It is. When Stu and Drew of Rugrats were kids, what was the name of their favorite television show? Uh, is it like a... It's a parody of an old cartoon. Ah, there you go. The Rockstones? I give up. Blocky and Oxwinkle. Uh, uh, <laughs> I never realized that he made a reference to Rocky and Bowling, but that's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> what is the name of the Where's Waldo Christmas Adventure video? <laughs> what? <laughs> I guess it was on the Mick. <laughs> yes. Where's Waldo Winter Wonderland? <laughs> the Merry Xmas mix-up. No. Mine sounds about it. <laughs> it does. Winter Waldo Land? Where's Waldo? In Winter Wonderland? Yeah. Bo -bo 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 -bo. Well, w. Bo -bo -bo -bo. In Where's Waldo? Is this a fucking cartoon? I gotta find this. <laughs> the meanie genie of Aladdin's lamp. What character interrupts the story to complain about not being in the movie? <gasps> Oddlaw? Yep. Yeah! <laughs> It's like, I was like, who would be a bitch? Oddlaw was a bitch. I don't know Will's Waldo. I remember I had, I had a game. <laughs> where's Whale's Waldo? I had a game where there was Where's Waldo. It was like a card game. I'm going to say you could just go to the Nickelodeon. <laughs> On Oswald, what? No, nah, I should keep going back and forth. We want lots of trivia in this video. You can cut it out <laughs> if you need to. But. On Oswald, what is the name of the quickly growing pet fish that Oswald buys? Goldie. 
Let it be. That means you don't get no more trivia unless you lay on Nick one of them. I'm trying. I guess I should just go to Nickelodeon. <laughs> just want to ask me. Now, you get to choose. You get to look at all the questions. You get to choose whatever question you want to ask. If you want to dick me over, then dick me over. I guess. This would be impossible. <laughs> it's going to be all shitty trivia if you want. You might get this one, but it's level five. Which band of Musical Brother guests starred on the Three's Company, a.k.a. Keep the Change, episode of No One Knows Best? Which musical? Musical Brother. Jonas Brothers? That's two of them. Hanson. Uh, thought you would have nailed that one. Come on, green. It's a green. One or four. You cannot have one. Four. Four? It, ah, Jesus. On SpongeBob SquarePants, how many tentacles does Squidward have? Wait, does his arms count? Tentacles. Six. Mm, yeah, I think you're right. Yeah, you're right. Maybe should I get to No. Choosing. Another Where's Waldo. Yeah. What is the name of the 1992 Where's Waldo video? Which Waldo must find a lamp to save people of lamp mania. Um, genie troubles? <laughs> we actually said pretty much this whole thing. And a lot of the other questions. <laughs> the meanie genie of Aladdin's lamp. <laughs> to relax. <laughs> Alright. Well, then, Dad. Granted, he had a shitload of movies. Yeah. <laughs> Who knew? Well, the Adventures of Jimmy Neutron Boy Genius. In what town does the show take place? Fuck, I should know this too. You should definitely know this. It's retro. Though. Yeah. I was, I, it, what made me remember was retro. retro land. But you know what? Oh, I almost saw the backhands. <laughs> did you see it? I don't think I did. It was all blurry text, but I might have seen how big the words were. Let me choose a different one. <laughs> I'm just going to stand, like, my eyes over here. <clears throat> the Angry Beavers once became waiters to try earning enough money to buy what? Oh, uh, it's a big TV? No, it's a set of rubber horror movies. Oh. Uh -huh. Where does the character of Stinky on Hey Arnold hail from? Philadelphia. Arkansas. On Dora the Explorer, which character has a rocket ship? Diego? No. I said it is a... Oh, is that a little squirrel? I don't know. <laughs> this could be a lot. <laughs> In the world of Dora the Explorer, <laughs> what is the name of the mean magician who cast a spell on a king and queen? Meanie genie. It's Spanish. El mean genie? <laughs> El mago. <laughs> I don't watch fucking Dora. <laughs> you should. Oh god, I'll Dora the Explorer. Keep me up. They're all Dora the Explorer. <laughs> you just go, like, Dora the Explorer call the special eggs that she searches for on her egg hunt. <gasps> El Huevo Special? What is it? Cast Carnival Homes. <laughs> Dang it! I mean, I knew that because my dad always eats. Well, I didn't know that. Well, my dad always gets salsa and eggs. It's called huevos rancheros. I'm like, huevos is eggs! But it had nothing to do with eggs. <laughs> well, there were Easter eggs. On Dora the Explorer. What does Boots' daddy do for a living? It's a show. They probably do something. He doesn't sit around and eat bananas. <laughs> That's not all. <laughs> well, that is a living, but... Uh, uh, carpenter. N no. It's oh. construction worker. It's oh, clothes. That count. It does not count. <laughs> the carpenter does not build giant buildings. They yes, build they do. <laughs> Different. Keep going. Son of I'm not bitch. giving this one up for that. That's half a point. <laughs> it's not enough to get another half point. When a mishap caused the angry beavers to become furless, who taught them to appreciate their nakedness? <gasps> oh, Jesus. It's a bear. Does that have a name? It's not a bear. The bird of singing sheep. Ah, I remember that one. On Dora the Explorer. <laughs> What's the name of the adult octopus who drove an ice cream truck, a mail truck, a submarine, and worked in the library? Kinky. No, you want me to give you a second chance? Maybe. It's a name you know and a name you like. Owen. Oh, no, it's Val the Octopus. <laughs> we can't go. We're going to find One of these is going to be like a SpongeBob one. We'll go. Oh, that's easy. Yeah. On what Nickelodeon show did the radio station KDMP? Hey Arnold? Ah, uh, Real Monsters. Damn it! Son. Who performed the character Ear Boy on all that? Oh, I don't know his name though. It's Josh something. 
Damn it, you already have a half point. Is that your other half point? <laughs> no, I want you to answer. <laughs> this is a, you got a third point. This is your second third point. Unless, if you can get the other half. I don't know what kid would know the actor's last name. Yeah. I, I do know it's Josh. It's Josh Sturber. So now you have two thirds. <laughs> one more third point. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad I remember Josh. Yeah, no, like, I, I pictured him in the, he had the giant ear. I had no idea. Ear. I was going to say Cal because I had no idea. No. Was, it, was it Cal Mitchell? Keenan Mitchell. See, like, I, I wouldn't know their last names. I know, like, they're first. Like, I obviously Amanda Bynes. But yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just want to win this game. In Angelica's rendition of American the Beautiful, beautiful on Rugrats, the song opens and goes, Oh, beautiful for what? Oh, beautiful for what? The song goes, Oh, beautiful. Oh, steaks, snakes and ties? Spaceship eyes. Oh. We're learning trivia. <laughs> you can remember this for later. Um, in Blue's big musical movie, what did Blue say she wanted to be when she grew up? Fire dog. Teacher. <laughs> She's a dog. <laughs> She's dog position. Teach you how to poop and eat. <laughs> and all stuff. In Blue's big pajama party, what storybook did Steve read to Blue before bed? Um, all dogs go to heaven? No, good night, bird. Oh. What Oswald character shares her name with a famous opera and play? Probably also an animal, since everyone in that show is an animal. Except for the snow one. Cats? No! <laughs> That's bad by production. It's Madam Butterfly. I wouldn't know that. Jack Riley, who provides the voice of Stu on Rugrats, is best known for his role on one television, the most successful series. Can you name the show and the role? The Simpsons? Bob Newhart, where we played Tough Patient Elliot. No idea. Ooh. Why did Invader Zim fail in his first planet invasion attempt? He went to the wrong planet. No, so he couldn't see over the control panels of his invasion vehicle. So he might have crashed? I don't know. Yeah. What is the name of Vicky's dog on the Philly Hawk Parents? Look, I, I didn't see it. When I see it, I'm like, oh yeah, because I knew she had a dog. Bug. Is it Nippy? Adorable. He's only shown up a couple of times. And I've seen the dog too, I can picture him. But... I wonder if you know this one. On the adventures of Jimmy Neutron, Boy Genius, Jimmy created a robotic salesman. What did he name his creation? I, I know the episode too. He ended up selling all of Jimmy's stuff and sold Jimmy's dog and stuff. I think I even know that one too. I just remember his. The Willie Loman 3000. Yeah, I, I know the episode though. Like, why those should we start? Dollars. Should we start going down to question four stuff? Never. <laughs> okay, question five to the end. What was Nickelodeon's first originally productive program for kids? Ooh, really? This is old shit, isn't it? Yeah. Is it Rugrats? No, double there. Oh, I was gonna say it's not a cartoon. No, it narrowed down. Yeah. Name the Nickelodeon show and episode that became the highest rated kids program in cable television history when it aired on Saturday, July 21st, 2011. Then one. 2001. Well, that was the shows for me. Um, name the Nickelodeon show and episode that became the highest rated kids program in cable television. I guess it would be... Well... I do remember kind of when this came out, it was a big deal, but it's, I'll tell you, it's not like a brand new show, but it sort of is. It's not Spongebob. It's probably not Rugrats, because I was around on that. It actually was Rugrats. It was Rugrats. Do you think of what episode might have been? It spawned something else. Like the birth of Dale Pickles. No, it was, <laughs> it was all grown up. Remember they had that they had the episode first where they all imagined that they were big kids and then they made a TV show out of it that was all them grown up. Yeah, that show sucked. And failed. That's what I was telling you. <laughs> that the second show didn't last. Uh, damn. I <laughs> keep on going. We're not going. <laughs> we're supposed to play another game today. In all the episodes of Blue Clues, how many times has Steve found a clue all by himself? Three. Once he found the first clue. Ooh, what's the name of Chucky's birth mother on Rugrats? Oh, fuck. There's that whole episode 
where he finds it's all these pins. So no. Yeah, I know. Mona. Melinda. Oof. I was just pulling shit out of there. <laughs> you come, you almost pulled the right piece of shit out. <laughs> On Rugrats, Grandpa Lou and Stu once entered Tommy in a what baby contest? A, a girl's beauty pageant. But what's its name? It's got a name? Yeah. Oh, it's called like Pretty Little Angels or like Pretty Powder Babies or fuck, I know the episode too, but Little Miss Lovely. Uh, uh, wow. I'm starting to remember that too because he just the girl. Yeah, he's all got the curls. <laughs> uh, at the beginning of the Ah Real Monsters episode, it's only a movie. The movie theater is called the Wahorn. Who's it named after? Bill. Hungarian artist Andres Wahorn. <laughs> We're gonna find one eventually. <laughs> we, we saw one earlier that was like a level five fucking easy, didn't we? It was level four. Oh, uh, okay. No, uh, you're probably gonna get this one. What was the title of the Rugrats' first direct to video release? Oh, it's the one where they're. Is it just called the Rugrats? Oh, no, direct video. Because the Rugrats movie was in theaters. Um, was the Rugrats all grown up movie? Vacation. <sighs> I actually thought it would be a. You know, they had like hot discussions, but they thought it was direct to video. Sucks. And little Bill, who are Andrew's two little older cousins? The fuck is little Bill? Oh, that's the show. Oh, it's little Bill Cosby. It's little little rapist. No, he made that. I don't think he's. It's supposed to be him though, is it? Well, it's little Bill. I got nothing. It's um, Rachel and Kevin. I was gonna say. Rocky. <laughs> Shit dynasty. <laughs> Little, more Little Bill for you, Jake. <laughs> That's what you think about Little Bill. <laughs> what's the name of the, oh. of the man Little Bill's... What's the name of the man Little Bill's teacher? Is Murray married on the show? Um, Johnny? The doctor. Dr. Johnny. <laughs> Crinkle sales. <laughs> Dr. Crinkle sales. It says Little Bill just tosses it aside. <laughs> On Caitlin's way, oh, I've never heard of that. <laughs> Caitlin meets Bandit when he rescues her from what? Drowning. A rabid wolf. <laughs> I want to see that show now. There's <laughs> a drifter and a rabid wolf. <laughs> what is that show? I feel like. Dark right. Explorer, where does Baby Bluebird live? In a treetop. Close. In a little blue tree. Oh. This is ridiculous. <laughs> On Oswald, how many marshmallows does Henley routinely take in his cocoa? Three. No more, no less. You got no, you got it. Oh. Three, no more, no less. <laughs> well, Do I need now, the rest of it too? I want a chance to save. I get one more card. No, you are fine. But this give me a chance to bring it back into action. It's we'll my no, we won't tie. We'll start again. <laughs> if I get this one. On what episode of Rugrats did the All Real Monsters make a guest appearance? Oh, fuck. That, that's creepy. I guess he did do both of those shows. They're all, like, shaky. That's gross, though. <laughs> um, All Real Rugrats? All, all Real Humans? Ghost Story. 